it's smart what they're doing. They're all they're trying to do is just help us all wake up, man, and just realize how fucked up this country is, you know what I'm saying? Realize how fucked up people are. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people follow these rappers and follow these politicians and shit thinking that they're gonna help them and they don't help nothing, man. Seems like my life been really changing on me. I know some niggas out here hating on me. Hey, I see the bitches how they changing on me. I know some niggas out here snaking on me. Hey, see like my All right, now it's time to get our sex one from your boy Samson. You know what I'm saying? Not Samson like the phone, but Samson. This one's called Ball If I Want To. I don't know if I heard this one. I think I might have heard it a long time ago, but I don't remember it, you know what I'm saying? But I'm trying to bottle if I want to, too, which I was gonna go bottle today if I wanted to, but I blew my motherfucking tire on my trailer, so now I can't even go finish that job, which I need to finish that damn job, because I've been working for two days, and I ain't gonna make no money off of it now. Some bullshit. But anyway, I need y'all to like, I need y'all to subscribe, I need y'all to share, hit that bell button, let everybody know what's the damn deal. Comment down below, let me know who else, what new artists, or what other artists, or what other song I should be reacting to. If you're new to the channel, like I said, please subscribe, because that's how we all get what we want. I give y'all what y'all want, y'all give me what I want. And now we're together and we love each other. <laughs> but anyways, let's get into this one. This is Ball If I Want To Remix. I fuck with this dude for real. Wait, hold on. Huh, Pizza Planet Delivery Shuttle. Sounds scary. You all right? <coughs> sick as a motherfucker. Damn. I'm so descriptive, every word I spit is so legit, it's like watching a flick when I cut a verse. <laughs> the moment you open the shit that I posted, it's just like a motion pick no one's- Hey man, I love how this nigga rap, bro, how he flows, man. He's so underrated. You know what I'm saying? He don't look like the typical rapper, which rappers only look like the typical rappers because everybody wants to look like, like you have to have big chains and Louie and Gucci and all the extra shit, which you don't have to have none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? You can still be you. And still make all that money, you know what I'm saying? But my thing, I love this nigga flow. This flow is so sick when he does what he do. Ain't nobody really flowing like him. Like, real talk. Script is coming close to this. I'm like a film on a rap because I'm real and I keep it rolling, bitch. Ah. This shit is so universal. It's easy to try and relate. I'm just trying to make my dream work. So as soon as they open the lion's gate, ah, it's over for y'all. I do it for pussy. I learned how to rap just to pork your mother. I made a movie with your sister. She's about to be famous. I told her to warn her brothers. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, you hear all the shit that he, uh, the little metaphors he has for Hollywood, all the shit from Hollywood, Lionsgate, and motherfucking Warner Brothers and all that shit. This shit funny. I like his word flow, his word flow and shit. Corner cutter, now. I made a movie with your sister, she's about to be famous. I told her to Warner Brothers. Uh. You're just a corner cutter, never been uh. a hustle. You were born a sucker. You just make up excuses so you don't have to do shit. It's always one fucking thing or another. Rock uh, always. Others still on my early in the morning while you lay drumming under the covers. Always lagging down, you got to give this prick a Viagra pill just to force him upwards. <laughs> I'm cold as fuck. I freeze yeah, water when I walk in this bitch. That's Damn. why your girl has a frozen pussy because I make her wet when I talk my shit. Uh. That nigga's a fool. Oh, that nigga's a fool for that one. <laughs> I gotta give him that one on that one. That shit was cold. Too cold. Like he said, when he walk on water, he, when he walk by, he make a girl pussy cold, frozen. That nigga stupid. <laughs> Took her home and then I hit it so hard that I broke it to pieces like Sub Zero. Then she got ah. the top and after she got done, I gave the writer a review like Doug DeMiro. <laughs> was like getting addressed and showing her breasts. They send me nudes and ah. I really like it. It's very inspiring. It motivates me and gets me moving. Ah. They asked me to send something back and I say, okay, I guess I'll do it. But it's kind of small, so you got to zoom to see me jerk off like Jeffrey Tubin. Yeah, I didn't funny. think I was on the call. <laughs> what happened? Cuz got cut jacking up? What happened? Cuz got cut jacking up? That shit funny. Other people could see me. You so, thought that you had turned off your camera? Correct. I thought that I had turned off the Zoom call. You don't want it anymore. I didn't get back to my phone. I don't believe it looking like a Tarantino figure. Really think you're in my lane, but you ain't nowhere near me. You're just busy hanging out to the side like a carabiner clip. Uh -huh. Just a parody. It's embarrassing. You get jealous and you get compared to me. I'm a courtesy. Anything you can apparently do, I'm like a bear in a zoo tearing through the barriers. So you better prepare to be fooled. Uh -huh. You're sweeter than tiramisu. I don't buy into the narrative you spew. Hey, man, that nigga, he, he killing him with the words, but uh, have you ever had tiramisu? It's good, you know what I'm saying? But he can't. We said about the bear. I'm gonna run that shit because he's something about the bear. 
Let's go back, hold on. Looking like a Tarantino freak, you really think you're in my lane, but you ain't nowhere near me. You're just busy hanging on to the side like a carabiner clip. Uh. This is a parody, it's embarrassing. You get jealous, but you get prepared to be. I don't care to see anything. You can apparently do him like a bear in a zoo, tearing through the barrier, so you better prepare to be food. Uh. It's sweeter than tiramisu. I don't buy into the narrative you spew. I don't claim to be the toughest, and I never will, but I swear I know scarier dudes. Uh. Acting like you're gonna square up and shoot like the old Western movie characters do. The Man, real talk, these niggas ain't about that life. They ain't offer to do none that they talk about doing, bro. Real talk, they ain't gonna be doing none of that shit. At all, bro. A lot of people who speak that shit on these cameras is not really about their life that they do. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't see me talking about game bang, do none of that shit, because that ain't what I do. You know what I'm saying? All y'all see me talk about living my life, being happy, and barbecue with my partner that live right across from me. You know what I'm saying? It's all the fuck I talk about. And my kids. You know what I'm saying? And me want to find a girl. That's it. But now I don't be talking about no bullshit. The life I really live, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm in the streets, not like that, but I'm in it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, I get down with anybody. If you want to fight, nigga, I'll fight you. We want to shoot out, we shoot out, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, a lot of these people are just fake as fuck, man. The only time you hold still for a draw is when somebody's doing a caricature of you because you're goofy. Uh, because you're goofy. Real talk. I got to get my boys flowers like I always do. I get everybody flowers that I do because I love the people that I do reactions to. I really do genuinely like their music, you know what I'm saying? It's smart what they're doing. All they're, they're, they're trying to do is just help us all wake up, man, and just realize how fucked up this country is, you know what I'm saying? Realize how fucked up people are, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people follow these rappers and follow these politicians and shit thinking that they're going to help them, and they don't help nothing, man. They found, people keep telling me to vote. Vote for what? Voting does not work, man, you know what I'm saying? Especially for black people. Voting do not fucking work, Okay. I'm sorry, I'm not gonna vote, never will I vote. It's not helping to vote, I promise you that. We need to get away from politics and fucking all this other shit and do what we need to do as a whole. Stop worrying about what a politician gonna do. How the fuck we gonna let somebody I ain't never met in my life? Never will I ever meet my life, run me and tell me what the fuck to do, where I should go, how I should act, how I should dress. Y'all got me, I'm grown, nigga, do y'all understand? I'm a grown ass fucking man, I would never in my life listen to people who ain't got shit to do with my motherfucking life. I promise you that. Shout out.